Welcome everybody to the Shadow Demon Dating Simulator. I mean, no players online. I don't really have to agree with the name the developer gave this game, do I? Now before we continue leaking that juicy lore off of the demon itself, when I was editing, I noticed a couple of places where secrets might be hiding. Now I'm not sure if they'll be there, I just have a hunch. The first hunch would be the Mind Friend app. Now this is just Minesweeper, but what if we mess with it? Now usually when you play Minesweeper, you want to clear the entire minefield, right? Without touching a mine. What if we do the opposite though? The game is called Mind Friend. What if we sacrifice him every single time directly on the first round? Now we can do that. When we open File Explorer, there was that file where we could have messed with the number of mines in the game. I have to find it though. Mind Friend data. Why am I lucky today? What bad, horrible thing is going to happen to me? When we open it, it says Mines 20. Now I should have checked this before I open this text file. How many places are there in the game? 150. That way, every single time we press a square, there is going to be a mine there. That way we can off the friend immediately. And I don't care. Whoopsie daisy, my hand slipped. Let's open mine, friends. Is there a mine in every single square? Boom! Now he's sad. Oh no, poor mine, friends. I'm gonna be sitting here for quite a long time, one time. What is that? One lost mine? Wait, 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 the coordinates, the coordinates. I have my phone in my pockets. Oh my God, what luck. If I had to guess, this square is the one where the demon might be hiding. Now let me just quick save the position of this square before it goes away. No, that is the file explorer. And now for a grand reveal. What is hiding behind the square? Nothing. Are you, are you sure about that? Nothing? Uh, okay, I'll try one more. Time. Eight. We found a secret! I knew it! We found a secret! It is the first number! It is the first number! Big brain! Let's go big brain! Now we do need to get pin codes for the other accounts. I knew they would have to be hiding somewhere. I just did not know where. It just happened to me that there might be one in mine, friend. <laughs> so let's crank up the mine amount to the max. Now, of course, we have to try the exact opposite. So let's crank down the mine count to literally zero. We're going to win every single time. Open up my friends, click on the grid, and we immediately bloody win. Are you going to reveal a secret number? You have to. You have to. Yeah, yeah, yeah you, you have to. Come on. Come on, do it. Whoop. The mine is somewhere around here. You have to. Come on. Come on. No. You. Bitch. Now I'm also noticing the second text file. This ain't the marriage proposal I wrote. This is something completely different. What? Why is it called a marriage proposal? Am I supposed to be taking this as a... As a refusal to marry me? Oh, come on, Satan. Have you seen me naked? Uh, that is incredibly weird. You know what? Let's not worry about it. Let's let's go search some more. Let's go snoop around and find out. Pictures! Oh, come on. I want to see some pictures. Can I upload my pictures? Naked pictures? For Satan? Downloads is just downloads, right? Summer days, something. CTF? Oh, it's this one. It has a README. Uh, uh, 1973. Should I write it down? Probably. And the date right now, at least in game, is 1993. I'm going to write all of these numbers down because all of them could basically be pin codes. Snooping. 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 Snooping a lot. Now there are other files here. I can't open them. I can't even rename them to a text file. I mean, there are no 
file extensions here, they're probably hidden or they don't exist at all, and a computer just somehow knows what kind of file they are, they are. but I can't, I can't change them. There is no classic right click, I can only left click, and when I left click, I'm going to be... Why can I move them like... That is gross! Ugh! <laughs> you! Haunted! Haunted game! Put it back! Anyway, this thing I just experienced gave me an idea. What if I go to packages and remove Gorge? Gorge is the haunted level, the only level there is in the game. What'll happen if I just... Whoopsie daisy! It's not in the files anymore. Okay, we're going to test it out later, okay? I still have some snooping to do. I'm doing detective work today. Unpaid detective work. I really need to get a life. Wait, I just realized that aid we've gotten there. That wasn't a code, that was the amount of mines there were around that grid square. Oh god damn it, I got my hopes up. I haven't found anything. <laughs> no. Wait, I got so lucky that I found that one singular square where there wasn't a single mine. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I thought I found something. No. How am I going to get into the other accounts anyway? You can't tell me that's outside of the demo. I know this is a demo. I, I, I still want to catfish people. Okay, we still haven't been in the settings. Let's open the settings. Maybe we can remove system 32. Master volume. Oh, this is like game settings. Come on. It just broke my immersion. How dare you? Ah, immersion gone. Is there something in the world one chat outside of the non-online demon, man? I can't see anything here except for this and these are just letters. Random. Random letters. I don't think there is anything written there. Maybe you can decipher it. I have absolutely zero idea. Well, anyway, I'm going to click on this. Now, this directly sends us into the Inuit Games Alpha Test. May I, please? I may. Boom! No! Now, do you have a beta test? Beta? Are you beta? Oh. Ah. Why? <laughs> what? Okay, why does just Inuit Games not DE redirect me to the alpha test? I don't want to be redirected. Bruh! Time to do some more snooping. Click. This website's got news feed. Thank you for 800 members, admin. Annual game contest. Sign up open. Admin. Site update. Sticky posts. Admin. Ah, he learned how to spell, I see. Your visitor number. One, two, five, six, two. Does it change if I reconnect? It does. It does go up. Click, 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 click. Mm, click, 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 click. Are you going to get angry? Hmm, demon infested site. What are you going to do? Tattle on me to Satan? Mm, I would love more attention from him. Go on. Okay, this appears to not be doing anything. Or the demons are patient. Uh, let's click on rules and announcements. Yeah, there's a lot of shit here. Uh, this says sign up open. This says sign up open. This is contest. Well, this has to probably correlate to what we saw on the homepage. Uh, annual game contest. This one. So, this is the sign up. I can't click on it. It's it's been demon demonified. Are you going to call it demonified? <laughs> Sounds like demonetized. It, it's been demonized. Uh, it infused with demon. I don't know, choose your own demonic liquid. I'm not going to think about it any further. Oh god, we have rules by Sergeant Destroyer 2. What happened to Sergeant Destroyer 1? Respect and courtesy. Be respectful and polite to all members. Avoid personal attacks, hate speech, and offensive language. And treat others as you would like to be treated. 2. Content guidelines. Posts and discussions must be related to game development unless it's posted and off topic. No spamming, advertising, or self promotion without permission. Do not share or request illegal content on l or links. I'm not sure if you count demonic content as legal. I think demonic content could be related to game development. You know, demons like to play games. 
some of them probably also sit on their asses in front of a computer for 12 hours a day coding games. Unfortunately, we usually just know demons who interact with people on a personal scale, if you know what I mean. Did this video turn into how many sex jokes can I stuff into one minute time frame? Hell yeah. <laughs> Intellectual property. Okay, there wasn't much here actually. Aside from the content guidelines, which I made fun of. Now we've already been to the releases and work in progresses. That is where we got our fishing with knives and 20 summer days, which we have yet to finish. Now let me see if I can... Does this say game or gate or gape? Well, I can read this. The name of the person is Steve the Codist. Okay. <laughs> I mean, of course, it can't beat Jason Super Dev. Hell yeah. This says, so first visit. Oh, first visitor. What happened? Was the first visitor a demon? Oh, Lord. And I don't think there was anything here, either in the 20 summer days crack or the fishing with knives. Wait, what did he come and say? Finally, a dating sim on this website. I can't wait to play it. I ship Song Lee and Seo Jun. They're totes the ultimate OTP forever. <laughs> Excuse me, but what is an OTP? Also, I have a reason to believe this game may have been distributed fraudulently. Edmonds, can you please look into this? It's very concerning. Thank you. Game Dev Gabe. I know you! I, I've seen your shit! Your, your game got demonified, demonized, satanized, <laughs> satanatized, <laughs> sanitized. <laughs> Amazing game so far. On my way to coffee shop right now. Americano is a disgusting drink. I don't get how anybody can just drink coffee and water. What is wrong with some people? I think Americano tastes nice. <laughs> it's in the name, America. No, just add some milk. Please refrain from having coffee-based discussions on this post. Xro, liberate your data. Uh, I think it doesn't work, lol. Bad crack. I just downloaded this. Trash. Jason, aka Super Dev. Oh yeah. <laughs> We have the entire squad here. What the hell? Also, I just realized I did not finish reading the rules and announcements. This is... This is ominous. Okay, time to see how the demon has been entertaining themselves on this site. Post introductions here. This is probably going to be useless too. Hello users. Reply to this post with an introduction so people can get to know you. Please limit to one post and be civil. No advertising allowed in this post. I'll start. Name, Sergeant Destroyer. Not real name, of course, but I'd wish. Bio, I, bio, I made this website and I'm working on a space defense strategy game with a realistic propulsion simulation engine written in basic. Likes, Empire of Stars, not a remix, model building, philosophy and intelligence. So cute, good idea, Mr. Admin. Me, name Alice, bio, I like to do art on games, I love to draw cute Kitties, let's make games like a read above. Wait, one of the games could have been Search and Destroyer's game. He's been making... Oh shit, he didn't... He didn't put the name of his game here. Just that he's working on a game. You did not work on a name. Bloody damn it. Ah, uh, then we have John here. Name John Mullard. Where have I seen this? Ex-researcher at... Rheinisches Volksinstitut. Rheinisches Volksinstitut likes occult and esoteric belief history graphics engineering. You're the one who put the demon in the game. You're the one who literally coded an incantation for the summoning of a demon into the game. Because you felt oh so lonely instead of going outside to a bar, to a park, maybe. No, I'm going to code the summoning ritual for a demon to a game. Then people will finally like me when I have a girlfriend. You know what? I don't even care if the demon's gonna be a man. <laughs> Fuck that shit. <laughs> also, didn't I see John here? Didn't I see John here? I did. Yeah. Hello. You're the one who coded the demon into game. We also have Sarah here. 
I'm not sure I saw Sarah. He's here, and we can hack into his account. All we need is a password. After the hellish coder we have Terence Wilfrey, I'm a guitarist and vocalist from Austria, likes jazz, bossa nova, punk rock, Jason, super dev, yo, cool pose, I'm super dev, but you can call me Jason, currently working on my game franchise and already 20% done, I check out my profile to see history in making, oh that wasn't I, just check out my profile to see history in the making, you see I don't capitalize, my sentences. Appreciate your feedback. Not Jason, aka Super Dev. Hell yeah! Oh, Dev Gabe. I know Gabe. Hello, everyone. It's very nice to meet you. To e meet you. I'm excited to learn from so many talented people about me named Game Dev Gabe. You can call me Gabe. Game Dev Gabe is my username. We have eyes, Gabe! By a loving dad of three, born in Phoenix, AZ, Arizona. Beginner developer with a big dream. Likes hiking, fishing, meeting new people. Thank you for reading. Game Dev Gabe. Winston H. Richmond. <clears throat> Welcome everyone to the rest of your life! Want to know what I'm talking about? Look at my post and all topic and I think one ten one thousand one thousand one hundred thousand dollars every day for making games and you could be making it more don't believe me for reading my post you have nothing to lose best records Winston H. Richmond <clears throat> no advertising allowed locking post why did you lock the post why did you just, just delete his comment don't you know how to code this website just delete his bloody comment from the database you absolute agent you're going to destroy the website is that why you're called surgeon destroyer 2 you did not even spell destroyer correctly i just realized okay get out of here no get out of here shoop shoop now we're going into the good ones. Update on posts disappearing. <clears throat> Hello users, the location where our server was hosted caught fire. This caused many posts to disappear. We apologize for this inconvenience. Caught fire is summoning a demon an exothermic reaction. Thank you for your hard work. I noticed some old posts are still visible but can't be opened. Does that also have to do with the fire? Yes, it seems that a lingering after effect from the fire. It is a rather unfortunate. Maybe it'll fix itself. Okay, I'd hate to lose some of the music I posted on here. It's a conspiracy theory! You really think a fire could do that? Wake up! A fire doesn't choose what it destroys. It just destroys. Jason, aka Super Dead. Jason, warning for spreading misinformation. Locking post, you locked the post the cat! You double agent! Okay, now I might already have a possible lore explanation as for why is there the demon in the game? Maybe someone got caught in the fire, someone died, someone burned to a crisp, someone became a filet mignon in there. However, his soul didn't just transcend into the afterlife. No, considering that was the soul of an IT enthusiast, it gravitated towards the server instead, sucking and stuffing itself into a indie video game, which it then overtook and demonified, demonized, sanatonized. That. Are you, are you following me? It's probably a bit too far-fetched. Anyway, let's continue reading more. We have another post on the posts disappearing. Hello users, this morning we noticed a big chunk of the posts on our forum have disappeared. Uh, we know this must come as a shock to you all. We are currently looking into what happened and we'll update you all once we find out more. Surgeon Destroyer 2, yet this... This is less ominous than I initially thought it would be. What the hell? No demons? It was just... Oh, it's because of the fire? Seriously? I expected demons! I expected Satan itself grabbing the server with his own bare hands and his naked body, breathing his sensual exhalation into the ports, stuffing it with demonic energy. Is exhalation even a word? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but no, it was probably just normal fire. 
Maybe it was Hellfire. I have no idea yet. Let us move to the game design board. I still haven't been here yet. Yeah, all corrupted. Why? Same genre right now. Uh, something sequel first? To a sequel first? Super Dev? Oh, that's the... Right, right, this is probably the place where he was conducting his research about people liking sequels more than prequels. <laughs> that's why he made Fishing with Knives 2 instead of Fishing with, with Knives 1. Is feedback and help going to be so demonized too? No. Needs feedback on my art again. Hey guys, I made some changes to my art from last time. I would like some feedback again. Send me a message and I'll show it to you. Thank you. This is from Gabe. All right. I don't think Gabe has been demonified, demonized, <laughs> sanitized. <laughs> my magnum opus song for my game. Hey, game dev noobs. I made a song for my next game, Fishing with Knives. I'd like some feedback on it. Not, I don't value any of your opinions. <laughs> Just tell me it's good and move on. We can download it. We can download <coughs> coolsong.snd. Download it. Can we place it into the that the media player, the gramophone shit? <laughs> did I not destroy it? Why did I not destroy it? Open it. Open it. Yes. Play me the cool song. Is that a face? Poke. Poke. Poke your eyes. Poke your eyes. Ha <laughs> ha. Now you're blind. Eh. Is that how it works? That is... Mr. Face Demon, that is such a bad design. Anyway... Do it! Do it! Yeah! I thought that would be the good one from Fishing with Knives too. Is that why you partnered with that dude who can actually make music? This is horrible. It's even popping, and I doubt that's because of the eye demon over here spinning. Can I move some of these knobs? Click, click, click. Can I unscrew this? And that's it. It's still spinning. I doubt there are going to be any secrets here. I doubt, I doubt it's just going to say... One. Eight, two, four. Or any kind of a pen code in an ominous demonic voice. Okay, that's an interesting design. Also of the audio player, but also of the... The, 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 the song. What the... Okay. <laughs> I guess we all have our first bad sounding song. I have one too. I'm not an exception. Oh, Jazz Great actually commented. Hey, Jason. Uh, in the nicest way possible, I think this song could kill a small Victorian <laughs> child. <laughs> there is no direction. It's just random noises put together. Please don't put this in your game. If you want, I'll make you a song for the game. Ha! Look at this dude! You think you can make better music than me? Try me! Alright, I'll entertain your proposition. It's an insanely cool game about a guy fishing with knives. You kill fish and then you get money and buy upgrades? I know, it's big game design. Jason, aka Super Dev. Hmm, sounds cool. I'll make you a tune. Give me a little bit. I'll be waiting, stupid Jason, aka Super Dev. Have you given up already? <laughs> I knew it. Nobody but me can understand the intricacies of making music for my own games. Jason, aka Super Dev. Hey, sorry it took so long. Uh, here is your song. That's the good one. <laughs> That's the good one. <laughs> Wait, hope you like it. <laughs> it's so bad. I hate it. <laughs> Chaser, aka Super Dev. <laughs> Hey, this is it! Song for Jason! Put it in! Put it in! That's the good one! That's the good one! Go! 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 Yes! That's the one from Fishing with Knives! But why does it sound worse? Why does it sound worse? <laughs> I, 
The warning game sounds better. What the fuck? What is with this audio player? Is it because I shot it? That would make sense, but come on. Demon, if you like audio players and gramophones so much, you could have just fixed it. I've been playing with the dating sim. You had all the time in the world! Hey, this doesn't sound that good, I have to admit. Let's just... let's just... put it back... Just, no. Lastly, we have yet again Gabe needing feedback on his art. Hey guys, I just wanted some feedback on the, on the character art for my next game. Send me a message and I'll show you. I'm a bit too shy to just post it on the forum. Whoa! That's an amazing character! You're shooting for the stars, kid, and you're going to reach those stars with my help. Oh, this is the guy who was probably making either a scam or a pyramid scheme. <laughs> Check out my post and learn how to actually make money with your games. Best regards, Winston H. Richmond. Oh, thanks. I'll check out your post. I just wanted feedback on my character, though. The look of your game doesn't matter as long as people are buying it, son. Best regards, Winston H. Richmond. God damn, that's some bad advice. This is a scammer. 100%. Okay, lastly, here we have the off topic category. I can't open some polls. Make money fast, of course, from Winston H. Richmond. Can I block people from replying to my posts? This game probably wants to block Winston H. Richmond. Enter my store. Art by Alice. I think the other person who's got an account here on this computer is Sarah, not Alice. I don't think it's Alice, at least. Making forum banners. James the Coder. I can't open some posts. Hello all, I wanted to look at some old posts, but a lot of the legs don't work. Does anybody know the reason? Look at the announcements, the servers caught fire, and like 80% of the posts on this site got deleted. Yeah, a fire. As if. I bet the admins just forgot to pay the server calls. <laughs> I have secret info on why the posts got deleted. The admins are lying to you. Send me a message if you want to know the truth. I sent you a message. Answer me. He did not even sign himself. Oh god, what happened to Jason Superdev? Oh no. <laughs> oh no, the dude died. That's not him. That's a skinwalker. <laughs> Then we of course have Winston H. Richmond's Make Money Fast. Hello, poor person. You want to make money and change your life? Of course you do. Developing games is easy. Making money from them is even easier. With my help. I can show you how. All you have to do is go to my website below and sign up for my masterclass. <laughs> uh, so he's not a scammer. At least not in that way that he's going to, well, steal your money. He's going to steal your money, but <laughs> using his masterclass. <laughs> Prices start at the low price of almost $300, excluding taxes. <laughs> Click here to find out more. Best regards, Winston H. Richmond. Can we? Can we? Oh, dot org, are you kidding me? This domain has been seized. The domain for howtowinston.richmond.org has been seized by the European Bureau of Fraudulent Investigations. Uh, pursuant to a seizure warrant issued as a part of a coordinated law enforcement action taken against highly fraudulent activities and or individuals. Individuals. <clears throat> If you have any information regarding the whereabouts of one Winston H. Richmond, please contact your nearest law enforcement agency. We thank you kindly for your cooperation. <laughs> oh, dude's a wanted man. Hell yeah. <laughs> okay, this has been fun. Let's go back. Gabe asked a very good question. Can I block people from replying to my posts? Hey. Is it possible to block certain people from replying to my post? Hey Gabe, I'm afraid it's impossible to block specific people from replying to your post on our forum. If somebody is harassing you, please send me a private message on the chat app and I'll try to help. Oh, okay, thank you. <laughs> Was it the one and only Winston H. Richmond? <laughs> a wanted man themselves. <laughs> Enter my store. Alice. OMG, hello! Welcome to my store. I sell lots of wares here. Mm -hmm. I like to draw cute kitties. So if you want cute kitties in your game, yay. 
Hey, where can I repay you? Hehe, <laughs> just put the money on the counter. What? What counter? I placed my hand on the counter. This counter, dummy. It's right in front of you, XP. I placed $20 bill on the counter. I'd like one cute kitty drawing. Please. Ooh, this customer, this custom meow has money. <laughs> I'll get started on it right away. I take the money and walk into my office and start working. I'll send you the art when it's done. And she never came out of the office ever again. Because turns out the office now belongs to a demon. And it did not like other people encroaching on his domain or her domain or their domain. I have to say, I still can't believe how much love and care has been put into this game. Not only they made the cursed game, they also made fishing with knives. They also made the dating simulator. They have made all these characters on the forum. They have given them personalities. They have given them bounties even. <laughs> this is unreal. I'm amazed. I've been playing this almost like three, three and a half hours in total. I will say it again. This is a demo. This is unreal. Let's continue. Also, you know what? You know what? Come here. Come here. I have an important thing to ask. I can't. <laughs> the cable is too short. Let's continue. Come here. Come here. Closer. Closer. Enjoying the video so far? You better like and subscribe so I can get that cable management masterclass. Well, lastly, on this off topic section, we have a making forum banners. Is this a suggestion? Hi, uh, they call me Banner Guy. My name is also Guy, so that means I'm your guy. Your name is James the Coder. If you want a banner made to show your cool personality on this forum, just send me a message. I'll get right on it. A banner will cost you $25. Isn't $25 a bit much for a simple forum banner? No. Mine are like really good. <laughs> Uh, uh, James the Coder, uh, are you just going to ask uh, Alice <laughs> to give you a banner? <laughs> are you just going to, in asterisks, place a $20 bill on a counter so that she can make you a banner? <laughs> you know what? Not a bad idea. That is a common practice called outsourcing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually, let's not forget about the next page. Post your favorite songs. Post your favorite music below. I'm trying to expand my music library. Here's a song I made recently. I'm just trying out some new styles. Another song for download? Are there gonna be more? I mean, we already have three, but I don't count that first one. That first one is horrendous. Also, could you sort this? This is why a grid is so useful when dealing with files. Put it in there. Stop. <laughs> Put it in there. Can I bob? That one is ominous. Now, I can't remember which song did we hear when the demon first spawned the gramophone. Was it this one? Is the demon... Chaz Kareit? Is he the one who burned in the fire and got transported into the server? Has there even been a fire? Hellfire? I don't know, a demon summoning ritual gone wrong? I have no idea. I don't remember. It could have been the same exact song. But I don't know. If it was, that is hella creepy. Can I see you? Will my mind be able to comprehend you? You're playing music? That's it. If you spawned an entire gramophone. Okay, I have to say, you are, you are quite decadent, my man. Can I shoot? Yeah? Okay, that is everything for the off-topic category. Now let's go back to rules and announcements and try that thing I was talking about. You was talking about a remix of Empire of Stars. Empire of Stars. Did I write it correctly? Hell yeah, better than his nickname. Okay, it finds everything. Can it find users? 
destroy your... Yeah, it can find threads which have been made by those specific users. There was that one person talking about how they know the truth behind the missing games, that it wasn't a fire. Here it is. Bite Bard Blake. This is the first time we hear about him, I think at least. Can I click on his face? Nope. Bite Bard Blake. Bite Bard Blake. Boom. Something? Oh, come on! I thought I found something! <laughs> Did I even found anything during this episode? <laughs> what am I doing? Yeah, we found some lore, of course. We got to know these beautiful characters that they made for the game. <laughs> But we didn't find any secrets. I still don't know how to masquerade as either Sarah or John. Yeah, it's Sarah. <laughs> I don't know what I can use for these. Okay, as good as this game is, I'm gonna have to leave this episode here. I know we've only done some lore digging, but unfortunately the other things are going to have to wait for the next episode. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please like, comment, or subscribe. It really helps my small YouTube channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!